Nearly 400 people with concerns about a pigmented lesion were able to self-refer to the Dalhousie University study that used an AI system called PhotoFinder to detect skin cancer early. We ended up finding 17 skin cancers, 11 with melanoma, which is the most fatal form of skin cancer. Marie Cavanaugh had one of the 11 cases of melanoma that was detected by the AI system. She since had surgery to have it removed. I feel like I've won the lottery, absolutely. To have uh, melanoma is very aggressive and it had spread to the point where uh, the next step would be invasive so I got it just in time or they got it just in time and I do feel very very lucky. One of the study's authors says it's a key development for cancer treatment. Luckily we were able to detect all of these in their very early stages when they were still curable but again it highlighted um, the lack of access and that there is a need for a screening program like this. A team of dermatologists, including Dr. Peter Hall, examined the images without knowing the AI results. The AI was at least as good at diagnosing and detecting melanoma as the, as the best of the expert dermatologist. In order to receive a skin cancer diagnosis in the province, you need a referral from a family doctor to see a specialist. But with nearly 150,000 Nova Scotians without a family doctor, Dr. Hall wants to see centers open province-wide using the AI photo finder where people can self-refer if they see a lesion of concern. He says that approach could dramatically reduce the time for diagnosis. It's really cost-effective compared to the cost involved if patients have their melanoma spread and require treatment. That can be in the, in the millions. Amber Friday, Global News, Halifax.